Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. So let's have a look at this awesome Elder Aspect Warrior Commission and also their designated Phoenix Lord, Jane Jar, the lady herself. Uh, Absolutely fell in love with these miniatures when they were re-released. Uh, I've always loved Howling Banshees, so to get the new plastic ones in as a commission and also Jane Jar as well has been phenomenal. Uh, this whole project has been worked on by Lloyd, one of the artists here at Siege. I know he had a really good time working on these new plastics. Um, again, it's a difficult one for me between uh, Striking Scorpions and also Howling Banshees because they're both close combat orientated, but I think there's a certain grace that comes with the, the Howling Banshees, which I just think is really demonstrated in their miniatures. Let's have a look at the Exarch to start off with uh, and uh, the Exarch can have obviously the Halberd or can have the uh, the dual swords which uh, obviously this lady has got and absolutely love this pose leaping forward about to slay someone and give someone a very bad day probably already killed someone with this sword and uh, about to uh, to give someone a whirlwind of death um, with the uh, with the other one but uh, yeah Lloyd's done an incredible job on highlighting all the respective areas of armor paneling uh, swords have got lovely shots sharp edge highlights on them uh, the hair is obviously all highlighted uh, we've got this really cool ivory suit that she's wearing plus obviously all the extra details the uh, tabard loincloth and all the belts and uh, bits of leather work there uh, all done through nice stages of highlighting um, really really do love the dynamic pose that this lady's got uh, again you've got that sort of uh, exarch headdress just with the extra little details and bigger sort of hair sort of plume as well behind her which I do really really love but uh, a great great pose just leaping forward there so that's just the exarch then we'll run through these uh, cool banshees really really quickly Again, Lloyd had a great time doing these. All the super sharp highlighting on all the aspects of the armor, uh, which is cool. The little trinkets and uh, satchels and bags all painted in that lovely warm brown uh, sort of color with those highlights just painted on nice and sharp. Um, and then we'll just have a look at these other ones just to show off the individual poses of these. Again, leaping forward there charging forward as you expect with any howling banshee uh, and then have a look at this other one going the other direction uh, absolutely love these uh, love the uh, little gems you see some red gems there and blue gems as well sort of those on the uh, center of the armor and just uh, on the lenses on the headdress or the head as well all with point of light source and blending done through there just so that every little catch light is all done uh, but that's just this this lady here just charging forward and then the final one before we have a look at the uh, the main girl herself uh, this awesome awesome sort of leaping about to leap pose which I do really like looking down the, the next target so that's just her then we have Jane Jar herself uh, always 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 loved um, this miniature and I think uh, GW have absolutely knocked it out of the park with this sculpt uh, show her in all her elegant deadly glory um, with obviously both the weapons uh, all sort of highlighted nicely in nice super sheen metal uh, as you can see um, massive hair plume as well she's definitely definitely not gone to the hairdressers in a while maybe lockdown has, uh, has uh, stopped her from getting a little trim but uh, but really really cool uh, sort of headdress uh, I love the way the miniature is supported by it as well I think it's great uh, and these flowing tassels just really show off that sort of dynamic aggressive attacking pose um, so same consistency on all the areas of edge highlighting on the armor. Lloyd's done a really nice sort of ghostly kind of like teal kind of effect on the faceplate as well, which I think really works and give this kind of uh, sort of uh, spooky kind of aggressive uh, sort of, I don't know, dead kind of look to her, which I think really suits. Uh, all the gems are done in a nice complementary red to the blue, which I think works quite nicely. Uh, and all the gold is sort of really warm across the miniature, both on the arm and also on the sort of uh, spear as well, which I do really love. Uh, as for basing, I haven't touched upon the basing. We've gone for this kind of like uh, urban kind of grey kind of scheme. Uh, obviously you've got some elder bits of scenery on her and also the exarch um, and then obviously they just put tufts on the bases as well as per our client request but uh, but yeah a lovely lovely miniature uh, and just you can just see that subtle blending just done on these tassels as well it goes from light to dark in there just to really show the uh, the, the folds and where the, that, that sort of uh, tassels are catching the light which I really like uh, but yeah awesome awesome miniature uh, so that is Jane Jar and uh, her accompanying aspect warriors they're now off to go and kill some imperials I've heard so uh, you don't want to get in their way uh, hope you like them ever so much so thanks for watching the video guys I hope that you have enjoyed it 
While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Seeds channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.